looking back now to where I started um, as a young boy and having dreams and aspirations of being a footballer, um, the journey's been amazing. I think there's no greater reward than, than you know when a kid asks you for your autograph or when a kid says, I want to be like Tim Cahill. Hey, guys. How you doing? Hi. Hi. How you doing, pal? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How you doing? If someone like myself can do it, then uh, hopefully they can think the same thing that they can do. So sorry, I'm late. I had so many interviews to do in media before I come out. You're not a big boy. Nah. Stand up. <laughs> you are not taller than me. Nah. Like you beat everyone in the Premier League yeah, and yeah. heading those balls yeah. in the I mean. I think the hardest thing was just dealing with the fact that your brother's in jail. Some would always find a negative about me using my brother. I feel that I live all my family's career because I feel it's a responsibility. The sacrifices that they made for me. My brother was a good goalkeeper. My little brother's a good footballer. But I got the ticket to take me to England. We'll go after yourself, Dad. He was trying to get into the youth side of Sydney Olympic. And the coach, he turned around and said, Tim was too small, not fast enough. And he will never make it to NSL, to the higher level of soccer here. And that really made Tim determined. You've never looked back. And towards Tim Cahill! Brilliant! My favourite man you is Ronaldo. Is it? Yeah, I like Ronaldo. It's about you. He's got a... How are his celebrations better than yours? His celebration's not better. 